Hey, Alcunic here, back with more Golden Sun The Lost Age. Last time we've been working on getting into the Great Gabomba statue. And this time we're going to continue. I was a bit stumped with uh, a Venus Jin. Jenny that was uh, on the floor below us. So this time we're going to get that. Away we go. And we gotta fight for it, so let's go. Gonna cast Quake Spear, that's okay. You can take it. Gonna use Quake Spear again, that's okay, we will handle it. Man, I can never set that up in time. I give up. I give up on trying to set it up to whack something really hard. Anyway. Okay, that's it. And that is about that. That is the last real thing we want out of uh, out of the Gabomba statue, except for the Black Orb, which we're actually meant to get. So now it's finally time to be able to progress, which is great because I burned a lot of time mucking about. Drop the thing. Oh, I didn't drop the thing. There is a very rare chance that a red demon like that can drop a certain item, which would be nice to have. Okay, we can beat up a ghost. Like, two people can beat up a ghost. Just a little Gabomba statue, don't worry about it. <coughs> Focus your energies! Everyone, look over here! Let us now present our jewel to the Great Gabomba. Oh, Great Gabomba, please accept this, our humble gift. Please, Great Gabomba, accept this jewel. Then the creepy eyes open. 
Look! The Great Gabamba has noticed the light of the jewel. You are still not pleased? No! This time, he seemed like he almost might- he might- We must continue! Drums! More drums! Ah! So that's how it works! He's been failing because the conduit that channels his synergy is broken. Should we reconnect the conduit so he can complete the ceremony? Yep. I won't help them, Felix! They're the ones who stole my orb from the Madrins! Piers, I understand that you're angry at them, but it really is in our best interest to help. Think about it, Piers. Akafu stole the orb solely to perform the ceremony. So, what do you think he intends to do with the orb? He means to give it to the Great Gabamba. Oh! So, if his ceremony succeeds, the orb will be taken into the statue, and we're inside the statue! If the ceremony succeeds, we can go find the orb! I don't want to help that Akafubu, but... I don't like the idea of helping him any more than you do, but if we can end this without a fight... You're right, Shiba. Let's see if we can't help him finish this little ceremony. It looks like the energy char charge is supposed to run over these blocks. If we can just move these around a little, that might be en enough to complete the circuit. Ah, there we go. These panels have arrows on them. What do you think it all means? Look at the directions they point. I'll bet these will rotate the blocks. But how do we set the blocks back in place? Just pound them in! Won't that do the trick? We must, we must watch the path his synergy takes and move the blocks accordingly. Oh, the magic! The power of the witch doctor fills my body! At the count of twenty, I shall present our jewel to the Great Gabamba. Make your hearts as one, and dance for the Great Gabamba! That is so unfortunate that she's the one with the... Uh, ...pound. Ah, great. Okay, bye. They're all gonna fall down the pit. I'm not reading that. That one's fine. This one's fine. This one's fine.
This one will probably work fine. Probably wants to go down like that, which means... wants to look something like this. Oh crap. No it doesn't. No it doesn't. Okay fine. Oh. Just because I forgot. <laughs> This one doesn't matter. Also does not matter. This is correct. That's a waste of my time and effort. Really glad that counted. This should work, I think. We will see, but I also have to wait. <laughs> do do do. So how are y'all doing today? Now that I'm waiting on the Great Kabamba. I mean Akafubu. Hurry up, my guy. Pretty boring in here. I'm doing good. I'm really enjoying. There we go. And now we get this creepy close up. That's gonna be my thumbnail, by the way. Look, the Great Gabamba has responded to our gift. And it got worse. Did you see it, people? At last, the Great Gabamba accepts me. I shall answer his call. I shall enter the Great Gabamba. Wait for me, my people. The Black Orb. Where is it? I saw, I saw it rolling there. Came in through there and rolled along this groove in the floor. It vanished into that hole! It looks pretty deep! Can you see it? Do you think you can reach it? Hmm... No, I can't even see it. It's no use. Now, I'll never see Lemuria again. I'm lost forever from my homeland. Wait, hold on. I can see light on the other side of this hole. A light? There must be a room on the other side of this statue. Who... Who are you? What are you doing in here? Are you Kabombo? No. Then what are you doing inside the Great Gabomba? We've come to reclaim the black orb you stole. Do you really believe I will permit you to take it? Hey, watch it! You wouldn't even be in here if it weren't for us. What is that supposed to mean? Why should I believe you? I am Akafubu, the chosen witch doctor of Kabombo. Yeah, we know. We saw your magic energy flowing past us. See how this channel runs along the floor? Here, look! It runs all the way over there! The 
The thing is, the circuit was broken right there. So we completed the circuit so that your magic energy could go where it needed to go. But if you truly did this, then why? Why did you help me? We were sort of hoping that we could take the orb if your ceremony succeeded. Ah, so you've taken the orb? Then be gone. You have no further business here. But we didn't get the orb. It rolled through this groove and right through this hole. We saw a light through there, so we suspect there must be another room behind the wall. I might be able to retrieve the orb. Do you think Akafuru will really return the orb to us? Maybe we had him all wrong. I thought Akafuru was an evil man, but I guess we were wrong. You never can tell, Shiba. We've had little choice but to trust that he will we have little choice but to trust that he will return. Come on. Let's go, Felix. I have followed away his instructions and entered the final chamber. He told me that if I reached this chamber, I would become Kabombo's witch doctor. What must I do here to become a witch doctor? I do not know. Your black orb rests in the hands of the statue before you. Go on, take it. Oh, young witch doctor. You have succeeded in your task. You have found this chamber. How, who speaks? It sounded like it was the statue of the Great Gabamba. That's ridiculous! Akafubu, your magic has grown strong! At last you are worthy of the title Witch Doctor. I give you the feathers and gown that are the badges of your office. Akafubu, from this day forward, you shall be Kabombo's Witch Doctor. I've done it! I've finally earned the right to be Witch Doctor! At last! Yes! And there is one thing that remains for me to give you. Akafubu, you hasty fool. I had something else to give you, and in your haste, you left too soon. Say, you there. Yes, you, you, looking around there. I have magic for Akafubu. Magic that he will soon need, but he is not ready for it. As a result, I have decided that I shall not pass this magic on to anyone just yet. Tell this to Akafubu. If he desires this new magic, then he must earn it himself. If Akafubu does not refine his magical arts, then he will never earn this new power. This power shall not be realized until he ceases living only for himself, and instead lives his life to benefit others. Tell him so. I don't suppose you could just give that magic to us? What do you mean? I'm just asking if maybe we could earn that magic before Akafubu. The power can be claimed by another, but only if Akafubu lacks the will to earn it himself. Aha, so we can get it. Perhaps if he must compete for his power, he will focus and take his office seriously. But before you do this thing... You must convey to Akafubu all that I have told you. Oh, of course. We wouldn't dream of cheating him. We will tell him all you have told us. Follow that path and you will find that cavern. But now I shall sleep. Until the time comes when I must anoint a new witch doctor. Felix, go get Pierce's precious orb. Got the black crystal. Give the black crystal to Pierce. Felix, do you have any idea exactly what this great Gabomba really is? Not really. You do not understand either? I do not feel quite so foolish. But doesn't this witch doctor magic seem not unlike some kind of synergy? Wouldn't it be quite fortunate if we were to get our hands on that power ourselves? Oh, you didn't need much convincing at all, did you, Felix? I needn't remind you, but 
We're going to need every kind of synergy we can muster to complete this quest. Either way, Felix, we are, at the very least, obligated to deliver the Gabomba's message. We must fulfill our promise to the Gabomba. Then, maybe we can come back inside this Gabomba statue some other time to get it. Felix carried the message of the Gabomba to Akafubi. By the time Felix finished his story, dawn had broken. Right, well, I guess that's that. You are virtuous men, coming here to deliver this message. My son and I thank you. What do we have to be thankful of? If they had just stopped me from leaving the Great Gabamba, this wouldn't have happened. What? If you had been more interested in your duty, you would not have left so quickly. But, Father, these people are trying to steal the magic of our people. It should be mine. Mine, I tell you. That power belongs to me. I'm going to be the one to get the Great Kabamba's magic, you'll see. My son, you have much to learn. He may look like a man, but before me he acts like a child. See how he behaves when he gets excited? No matter what I say, he won't listen to me right now. I think that he has had enough for today. I see your point. Well, I suppose we should be leaving then. After all, our journey has only just begun. We cannot remain idle much longer. Alright. Don't need to stick around here. And now we can go inside the buildings. Now we're going to just shuffle some of these things here. Why did she end up with a battle right here? can sell his battle maze for one thing. Don't need a weasel's claw. Don't need an oil drop. I'm getting rid of those two. And the battle rapier. Still only safety boots. It drives me bonkers. Kushiba. I'm sorry, we're gonna hear that 
buzzy noise a lot. Okay, and that doesn't. We have restock. We've finished up the great Gambamba. And uh we're we're pretty done with everything in Kabombo. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I think we're gonna like call it here. Oh, maybe we'll check out whatever this back room thing is. Oh my back, it's been aching ever since that ceremony. I really am too old to dance an idol. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna call it here. Uh, we finished off the Great Gabamba statue and dealt with Hakafubu, so thanks for watching. If you like this episode, don't forget to hit that like button, drop a comment down in the second below. And subscribe to the channel for more content. <coughs> uh, I'll drop a link to the tw to my Twitter and the Discord server down in the description below if you have any interest in either of those. Uh, thank you again for watching. Next time on Golden Sun, the Lost Age, we are going to continue on our merry little way and figure out what uh, comes next. See you guys then.